Hello. Today we are going to start drawing a bear and it has to be drawn according to the things which we done previously with the three round. Okay. So first of all we already made almost three rounds and accordingly we are going to make the bear. Let's see. Uh, first you have to start with the head and it's going to be done. You can see also, isn't it? Now afterwards we are going to be joined to its shoulder part as well as the legs which you have to prepare and the two legs the front legs you know or you can say the two front limbs as well as uh, we are going to join for the hind one also and it's going to be started for the last round shaped part and now the hind legs are going to be drawn with the small tail of the bear and uh, naturally it's quite easy you can see that if you practice it it's quite better to draw you know and it's a very very lucrative subject to go through so you can see it that what are the things shade and other sorts of things you can do that means whatever the values has to be done afterwards first you have to make that correct your particular gestures and all the things has to be maintained isn't it it's actually going to give a little force also now uh, we can see the next one which you are going to draw the same way we are going to draw you know that the three round shape of uh, already make the three rounds and now we have taken the uh, charcoal pencil you know it's better to draw because it looks a little bit darker anyway now the same way the heads you know the ear as well as going to be joined with the shoulder you know, and the last part as well you know and all the um, legs also we have to make first the front front limbs as usual the two limbs we have to make first one first two the pair of first the pair of legs which you have to draw first and then the hinder part you know the same way and you know it's quite the it's a huge body of the bear you can see that one due to the red reason we have to be a little bit careful that we have to make the balance also by making its legs in proper position uh, and you have to see the perspective also whether it's correct or not sometimes if it is little uh, difference just you have to maintain it so hope that you already enjoyed that one and i need your uh, likes comments uh, shares and as well as if you like it please subscribe and don't forget to give your good comments that if you whatever you want to do afterwards i can accordingly you can do it and we can do more tutorials so hope everything is good and fine. Uh, thank you very much for watching my video.